Hello everyone, this is Ron. Welcome to another Wuthering Waves video. I hope you guys are doing really well and I hope you guys are really excited for the global launch. And in this video, I'm going to take care of all the things that you need to do just before the global launch and what are the things that you need to know. And I will be talking about how to download the game, how to pre-register for the game and what are the system requirements that you need to do and how to approach the reroll thing because that's a sensitive thing i would like to talk about it as well and what are what will be the banners and i'll be, uh, briefly talk about these things as well so let's get into it and first thing first you would like to pre-register must must because you will get a bunch of rewards if you do the pre-registered thing. So just simply get into this website. I'll be leaving, of course, the link in the description and go ahead and tap on this corner. That's a, let's say a shape of a human being. Tap on it and it will open a box. Just uh, you can use your email to log in or either you can use any of your IDs. You can use uh, Apple ID, you can use your Twitter ID, and you can use, use also your Google account. Unfortunately, Facebook is not available in this case that I can see. So what I did, I registered with my Google. So just tap on this box that I certify that I'm 16 years old. This is confirmation of your age and tap on this Google because I did it with Google. But in your case, that might be something else. Just do it and ensure that your pre-registration is successful and the website will tell you that pre-register is successful consider following our web official website and these sort of things guys now a pre-registration is done now what else now there is another website which is this website where you can also do the pre-registration and also you can do the summons so let me do this uh, summons i previously already showed you that how to activate this thing a couple of weeks ago i believe you already did it now as you can see that i got a summon which is not good that is only cost one but i don't really care doesn't really matter at all because we will get this thing throughout the game in a in a many many ways so this thing is done this part is done now what we need to worry about first thing first we need to worry about the system requirement because as I said that this game is going to be big. So first thing first, let's talk about the system requirement of mobile. Then I'm going to talk about the PC. So let me take you to the... So let me show you the mobile requirements and mobile requirements is going to be something like this. If you are using an Android device, then your minimum system requirement should be uh, system version 7 that is uh, Android Nougat. But this is going to be the lowest requirement guys, to be honest. And Snapdragon 835 MediaTek. G71 or 72 processor or equivalent performance. Once again, this is the minimum, guys. But ideally, you should be using anything above this requirement, guys. The latest version, I would recommend latest version. Even the version that they are talking about, that 7 and above, don't worry about it. Just try to go to the latest version. And also the Snapdragon uh, generation, uh, Gen 2, Gen, uh, Gen 1, Gen 2, Gen 3. I would recommend Gen 2 or Gen 3 if possible. Uh, or MediaTek processor of equivalent performance and in in terms of space that's a big big problem for many people because huge space requirement guys 12 gigabyte of space you need to keep free for this game and remember that this is going to be the first time downloading the game the game is eventually going to go a little bit bigger when the more updates are going to be rolled in so this is the requirement for the android guys and ios let's talk about ios and iOS requirement is going to be iPhone 11 or above model. And once again, this is going to be the lowest requirement and iOS 14 and above operating system. Recommended device requirements, however, iPhone 13 and above. And iOS 15 and above is going to be the operating system requirement. I think iOS 15, it doesn't really matter, but iPhone version 13 is the, I think, standard because iPhone 11 I'm not really sure how comfortable you will be feel you will feel playing this game in iPhone 11 because this is a big game guys this is a big game and this will create a big pressure on the processor reserved space requirement 12 gigabyte once again same as android guys as i said that always try to recommend the, uh, use the latest 
uh, versions now let's move on to the pc requirement guys and i'll be taking you to the directory to the epic store or epic games and as you can see that they have displayed this pc requirement minimum requirement in this side and recommended requirement in this side honestly guys if you are someone who is playing for a long long time you should definitely go for the recommended guys to be honest and if you are a casual gamer like like many many uh, like playing uh, on, on a short time of uh, time every day i think minimum uh, will do but i would recommend the recommended one but for minimum we are having windows 10 uh, 64 bit or in the uh, 11 64 bit same in the recommended version uh, no not no change at all cpu uh, minimum version is going to be intel 5 9 generation or ryzen 2700 However, the recommended is going to be Intel 7 9 generation and Ryzen 3700. So quite high requirement in, in many comparison and the minimum requirement memory that is your RAM. Your RAM should be at least 16 gigabyte guys. This is the lowest requirement. However, I would highly suggest you to get 32 gigabyte. 32 gigabyte will at least ensure the smooth gameplay because this game has a graphics requirement guys look at this gpu gtx 1060 rx5570 for the first time uh, uh, probably i'll be playing a game that as uh, a mobile game that has a gpu requirement but the ideal gpu requirement is going to be gte and uh, gtx 62060 or rx5070 uh, xt or above now storage now uh, probably you already know that why gpu is important because whenever you play your games your games are actually played in your gpu guys gpu is the gpu part is used whenever the game is played so this is very important guys don't neglect these stuffs you can make the memory a little bit less but don't neg neg neglect the gpu stuff now storage requirement guys 30 gigabyte and both of, co of course i mean recommended and uh, ideal is going to be both 30 gigabytes so this is the thing about the pc requirement we talked about the mobile